Hello and welcome to Ray K Q&A, the show where Ray Kurzweil answers questions about the future. This week's question, what is the future of human evolution? At some point will be literally a hybrid of biological and non-biological thinking. But it's a gradual transition. It's not like, okay, now I'm going to do this and I jump from here to there and I'm suddenly enhanced. It's going to be a very gradual process. Just as, you know, these devices are ever more powerful. I mean, go back just five, six years ago, these were uh, flip phones that did very little and now suddenly they're, they're extremely powerful and people are adding augmented reality applications and keeps going gradually. People don't even notice it. They forget what things were like, you know, two years ago. And we will then merge even more intimately with this technology. Since it's the non-biological parts growing exponentially, it will ultimately be so smart, it'll be able to completely understand, model, and simulate the biological part. And then you can back up everything. And then we're effectively non-biological, even though we have a biological part. But we never let anything go. The transition is, is gradual, although exponential. So we're not suddenly changing who we are. We continue to have a biological body, but that's enhanced also. And we can experience other bodies, you know, in virtual environments and augmented reality. So we're not just limited to one body. So people always look at this and they think about, gee, what we're giving up. And gee, I like my body and I don't want to give that up. Well, I'm not talking about giving things up. I'm talking about enhancing our experience and our bodies and our brains. It's a gradual process. You know, just as you've gradually become the person you are. I mean, you're not the same person you were when you were a four-year-old girl. But where is that four-year-old girl? I mean, is she gone? Should we mourn her? Uh, well, no, she's contained in you. You've enhanced yourself to become who you are today. And uh, that's my view of how we'll evolve into really this sort of superhuman state. But I am uh, eager to move on beyond version 1.0 of our biological bodies. And particularly when we can have virtual bodies, we can be different people in different situations and we don't have to have the same boring body all the time. So. Thanks for watching Ray K Q&A. Stay tuned for a new episode every Thursday. Click here for more videos from Singularity University. Also, don't forget to subscribe.